For these questions, we're going to convert the measures, but all of these measures are going to have units of weight. Weight is just a measure of how heavy something is or how much gravity is pulling on it. In the customary system, there are three units of measurement. They range from measuring small things to measuring big things. The smallest customary unit of measurement is called an ounce. An ounce weighs about as much as a strawberry. So if you're measuring little things, you would measure them in ounces. But usually you want to measure bigger things. So if you put 16 ounces together, you make the next unit of measurement called a pound. And a pound is 16 ounces. It's about the size of a pineapple. So a whole lot of the things that you touch and interact with every day would be measured in pounds. But there are some things that weigh a lot, lot more than a pound. In fact, the next unit of measurement is 2,000 times bigger than a pound, and it's called a ton. So when you want to measure really big things like cars or houses or boats or anything that's really big, you would use the unit of a ton. So it takes 16 ounces to make a pound, and it takes 2,000 pounds to make a ton. So when you go to convert them, you're going to use the same strategy that you've been doing for all the other ones. Horse to fly, multiply, or fly to horse, divide of course. And so when you're going from bigger units, like tons, to smaller units, like ounces, you're going to multiply. But if you're going from smaller units, like a pound, to a bigger unit, like a ton, you would divide. So let's do some examples. On number one, we have 2,000 pounds equals how many tons? So we're going from pounds to tons. So we are going from smaller to larger, or fly to horse, so we're going to divide, of course. But what are we going to divide by? We have to ask ourselves how many are in one. So how many pounds are in one ton, and that's 2,000. So to find the answer, we just have to divide 2,000 by 2,000, and we'll get one. So let's look at number two. This time we're going from tons to pounds. So we're going from larger to smaller. So horse to fly, multiply. But what are you going to multiply? You're going to multiply by the number that's in one. So how many pounds are in one ton? Well, 2,000. So we have to do 60 times 2,000. So I'm going to do 6 times 2, which is 12, and then add on my four zeros. So the answer is 120,000. So 60 tons would be 120,000 pounds. So we'll try one more. Let's go from tons to ounces. So again, we're going horse to fly, so we're going to multiply. But multiply by what? Well, how many are in one? How many ounces are in one ton? Well, there are 16 in a pound, and then in a pound there are 2,000 ounces. So first I have to multiply 16 and 2,000. So, so there are 32,000 ounces in one ton. So my conversion rate is going to be 32,000. So now to find out how many ounces are in 42 tons, I have to take 42 and multiply by 32,000. So I'm going to do 42 times 32, and then at the end I'm going to put my zeros back on. So I have 1,344, but I need to add those zeros back on. So the answer would be 1,344,000. So 42 tons has 1,344,000 ounces. All right, you try some on your own, and if you need help, you can come back and rewatch the video. Good luck.